We're almost done with the, the, the lower cut around the room. It will be going to the top. It will be going to the top. I'm about to show you how to cut a fucking top line. With no problem. Because when it comes to people racing and shit, y'all got to count. The people with the um, sprayers, y'all doing this with a sprayer, y'all got to count the time it takes you to put the tape up, put the plastic down, take your sprayer, load it, prime it, do all this little stupid shit. All that time, I already then got the, call, the walls coated one time. Even with a sprayer, most of the time you still got to wait for that second coat. It ain't going to look right on one coat. That's what I'm saying. It's like there's no other way to do this. The fastest. I have been I've been doing this for years. I've been knocking out whole houses by myself, leaving people miles wide open, like, what the hell? How did you paint that that fast? Yeah, pretty much. Let's do the math. Let's do the math. Well, most of the time my my rates start at a hundred dollars an hour. So Oh, I, I kills them. I kills anybody that ever laid a hand on a paintbrush unless he was an actual um, painter like Leonardo or, or Michelangelo. No, Michelangelo was a painter. He did. Yes, he did. Okay. Like a real painter, you know? They paint portraits. But if you're a house painter, <sighs> how you doing? I'm the best painter ever in the world. Ever. First, I used to just be the pe best painter in my city, in my state. And then after a while, I realized it's not just that. Because I looked at YouTube, but then I looked at a lot of people on HGTV. And a lot of people, a lot of times I see these little, like, Mexicans have these little rollers and stuff. And I'll be like, okay. But then look how slow they moving. No one taught them about the C pattern. About putting a C. Who's supposed, you know, never supposed to roll straight up, straight down if it's your first roll. You fucking idiots. You put the shit on there with a C pattern. I created the C pattern. Because since I'm the best fucking painter in the world, I have to figure out what is the best way that you can do this shit and, and to put your shit on the wall the fastest way you can. And I effortlessly could, uh, fucking. Paint around anything. We need no tape. All right. We check out the walls. The walls are not dry, but the wall will be dry by the time I get finished with the top coat. I mean, cutting in the ceiling line. By the time I cut in that ceiling line, this should all be dry enough for that second coat. I'll show you guys. Like I said, this is a this should be an hour worth of work. You know, it should take a person an hour to cut a I mean, do a room right and be out free and clear. It shouldn't take you more than an hour. Oops, I ain't show y'all that long, that long cut. That was a real long cut. Cause I just keep going on and on and on. Then I take it back and I fan it, make it nice and smooth, you know. Then you just fan it like that. It's not. It's not that hard to do. What is wrong with y'all on YouTube? You fucking it. This is my first video, so y'all really have to excuse me on this one. I got more to come. Until I eventually make it onto TV. You know, because I am the best. I just need some recognition. As soon as people recognize me for being the best painter, it's on. I'm the best painter that ever lived.
Jerry didn't hook me up with a lot of paint jobs. A lot of people that hooked me up with paint jobs. Everybody just referred me. I'm just so referred. I don't even really need to advertise. I haven't advertised in over four years. There's no point. I'm so famous to be, like people just want to see me just do it. Like, oh my God, I can't believe I, his hand's so steady. Fuck. All right. I'm going to get my little ladder out here. My, my little, my little trusty dusty. I had this ladder since I first started. It's been very dear to me. Okay, now I can put the paint bucket right there and I can film the top of my eyes. Here we go, guys, we gotta hurry up. I'm racing against time. What is it, 39? Before an hour, we gotta get it rolled out again. Oh shit, Steve, you didn't even show that. Oh boy. Sorry, y'all, if I can't show y'all everything like that because I'll be going so fast. And I'm so slow now that I got my pink head in my head doing this shit. Gotta stretch as far as you can. You no, know, we'll never want to lose time. I have to sit this phone down.
videos, yo. Real shit. Go edit it up with that bullshit. It's my first video ever, yo. I don't know why it took me so long to try to make a video to show everybody down the best. Usually I just show people that I work for them the best. And they see it. And if people don't believe, if they don't believe when I tell them, look, I can do things in one day. I can knock out your house in one day. People be like, it's nobody out there that is this that can do that. Yes, it is. It's not a human nature, I guess, to be fast or to be. Some people are just idiots. I love my family, you know, I want to go home to my family. I ain't got time to be sitting around with these damn jobs, lollygagging, talking to people like I'm some type of boss all day, Ooh, talking it up with people. No, get the fuck out of here. Time is money. And the rest of my time is family. Nobody should care about nothing else. Life. All right, so I'm all done with the cutting on the ceiling lines. Uh, I'm about to get to the second row. Yeah. The wall seems to be dry enough to do it. So, so what you're gonna do, guys? The walls are shiny, but they're dry enough. They're dry. You know, it's shiny, but it's dry. That's because it's in my gloss, you know. Hold on. So let me get the rolling this out. And what time we got 49? Oh, we looking pretty good for an hour, you know. Look at this.
Okay, I'm going to just roll out this whole room. Even if you don't see me roll out the other side, I'll show you that. It doesn't take too much time. Okay, we had the roller sitting on the floor for a long time, but it's okay since I was doing this real fast. All right, so you see pattern again. Even on the second coat. Always do the seat pattern. Keep in mind, it's going to look real nice now. We're coming up on an hour. But before you go, it's your whole room is already painted, though. Congratulations. Oh, my gosh. You painted the room. Yeah, pretty much. I'm only using a gallon of paint. You know what I'm saying? One gallon. You fuckers out there using five gallons for one room? What the fuck is wrong with you? And then keep in mind, this is the second coat. So the room is basically done already. It's just touch-ups now. Had enough, guys. How you supposed to do? You're supposed to use one gallon per room. If anybody use more than one gallon, this is wasting money. Trust me. If you evenly pull it out on the first coat, your second coat will be fine. You don't have to go so hard on that first coat. Go up and down on your second coat. You know, make the right on your second coat. That gives your first coat time to dry so you can even put on the second coat. You don't have to go so fucking hard on it. I just did the whole room in an hour, probably less, but I don't even know after it takes it. I 
I just did this to show those people on YouTube that y'all suck. So when y'all go and put in YouTube best painter in the world, at least they would get some type of, you know, a real painter. It's not nothing those stupid little fuckers thinking they're the best just to advertise their stupid business. And they suck. They didn't speed up the video like, like that's them fucking doing it fast as hell or something. Like, what the fuck? That's not you? You can hear my voice talking while I'm doing this so you can see that it's live. And I'm doing this in live time. It's no way for me to try to face this. So until I get a camera through and everything. And I really don't see. Not really good. Really gonna kill the scene. Alright guys, so there we go. That's how a painter do it. And we still got a little paint up in here too. Still got about a little under a quarter. So now these are the walls. You got 56 minutes on there. And there's some touch-ups. Some touch-ups here and there, but the, the most part is the walls are all covered. Bitch. Now, see that touch-up up there? Yeah, I see it. See? It's just a couple, but that's some dabbing shit. You know, you up there, you dabbing, you know, get that little shit up there, you know? See that little shit around there and stuff, you know? But that's nothing. That don't take me a minute. Or two, or whatever. But that's just to show people. Look, we're going at 57 minutes, so credit the rest of the minutes that they told me to teach y'all all that shit, or whatever. We're just going to credit the rest of those minutes to the touch-ups. So this is a video of doing a room in an hour. This is how you pay the room two coats in an hour. Not including my touch-ups. about to go around and touch up all the little stuff, but it's pretty much done. I mean, really done. It's no putting on no plates, no doing no stuff. I just take my plastic and I'm out of here. And I'm done. Why not? Charge somebody $175 just to paint your walls. Just the walls on me. And you're out in an hour. Only guys on YouTube try to beat that. Try to beat that. Peace.